Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Miracle Monique. I post Christian and lifestyle videos on my channel. All I see is blessings, got no time for stressing. Don't believe in failures in my life, it's only lessons. They just make a room for what I'm And today I am coming with you guys with a Amazon starter kit. Um, I don't see a lot of videos like this on my channel. So I want to do a video like this because I think it's very interesting and I think it should be more videos on, you know, what it's like for women to actually work in a warehouse and what you should bring, what you should take, what you should not take and all that good stuff. So we are going to get right into it. And this can not only apply to women, this could apply to men as well. Um, these are some of the things that I use and take while working at Amazon and how I maneuver through a 10 hour shift every four days. So, um, every day for four days. So we're just going to get right into it without further ado. Uh, without further ado, let's get it. If you guys haven't subscribed, go ahead and press the subscribe button. And turn on my post notifications so you guys can get notified whenever I drop a video and we're going to get right into it so I had to go to my car so I can show you guys these things I'm actually gonna change the light really quick so I can show you guys um I'm out of breath <laughs> I'm out of breath so I can actually show y'all these items um and yeah so this is my Amazon starter kit and the first thing that we are going to talk about is these these ugly shoes okay so first okay they're not that bad but they're not like my first choice okay so these are safety shoes okay so every Amazon employee is going to need to own a pair of safety shoes does not have to look like these these are the women's safety shoes um, they have different styles of safety, safety shoes, different sizes and stuff like that. But when it comes to working to Amazon, you are going to need a pair of safety shoes. It is mandatory to have safety shoes at Amazon now. Uh, at my location, you cannot uh, actually get on the floor without safety shoes. And if you are on the floor without safety shoes... They are going to give you these uglier, the, they're going to give you like these like safety covers and they're white or black, I believe. And I had to wear them on my first day because I didn't know that safety shoes was that mandatory. Um, so yeah, so these are from Zappos. Um, so yeah, so we started with these bad boys because you're gonna need a pair of safety shoes and I will honestly highly recommend to wear safety shoes every single day so that uh, you don't have to wear those safety covers the next thing that you should want to bring with you every single day is not only the Zappo shoes but a water bottle okay so this is a water bottle that I use every day I actually need to take off these old stickers um, but I bring this every day uh, because your girl likes to stay hydrated. It's still water in here. Um, but it keeps my water cold. It keeps my ice icy. And uh, yeah, you should always want to stay hydrated while working at Amazon. Those 10-hour shifts aren't a joke. <laughs> Literally. And I advise that not only you bring water, but you bring like... Um, whether you have an energy drink, I don't personally drink energy drinks, but um, I like drinking elect electrolyte or uh, Gatorade. Um, so I always make sure I have either or plus water um, because you're standing at the shift for two hours and then break and then two hours and then lunch and then two and a half hours um, after your last break. Um, you're going to want something other than water. Well, that's just me. Um, but I don't, I don't, in, I don't drink soda or anything like that. Usually while I'm, um, working and, um, I do drink coffee. Um, and surprisingly my coffee actually lasts the whole shift. 
and you're probably like how um well because i'm not i don't have enough time to just actually like really sit and enjoy my drink so i'll just put my coffee off to the side cover it up um i do have this black thermo it's in my car it's a cup a coffee mug and it keeps the coffee hot um for a long time actually so that's what i use um as well so i put that in my lunch bag i put the gatorade in my lunch bag i'm not carrying all these things with me i'm just carrying this and then everything else is in my lunch bag surprisingly my lunch bag is actually big enough for all that this is something that I highly recommend, y'all, and it is a Bluetooth headband, okay? I got this not that long ago, and so far, I actually really like it. Um, the thing about it is, so, this right here is hard. It's a box, okay? And this is what, it's a box, and then it has a wire going around for the actual headphones okay so this part right here is a headphone and then on the other side it is a headphone as well the only thing is if this is directly on your forehead for 10 hours it's gonna hurt so what i advise is putting a headband on first and then putting this on and what you can do is like on the sides when you put the original headband on you can lift that one up and then you could just put this one over it does that make sense um just so the the first headband that you put on is actually helping your head um not get you know marked with this thing that's the only thing actually it's not the only thing the second thing that i advise to is if you are very excited to use this because you're trying to talk on your whole shift it's not going to work because when you are working at a warehouse mind you it's so much stuff around that it's very 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 hard for the other person to hear to hear you and for you to hear that person um i had got on a phone call and i was like i can't hear you i can't hear you and i feel like i was like shouting and no no we don't want that so this is really good when you're just wanting to enjoy the whole 10 hour shift uh with playing music uh the only thing well besides this part and not hearing like when you are trying to make a phone call the only con again that i have with this is I wish it was a little louder um when you are sleeping and stuff I'm pretty sure it works perfectly fine but I don't use this for sleep I use it for work so I would recommend it if um you are not trying to use like if you are not trying to talk during your shift um and also if you are good at listening <laughs> uh because they're they're okay like sound quality but they're not like noise canceling quality if you are looking for noise canceling quality this headband is not for you but other than that um it's really good I actually the last day on saturday that i worked uh, a lady she had a black one and um it was just dope like we were talking about it i'm like yo that's cool i would rather use this than use my airpods just because eventually my AirPods are going to go dead. And this actually lasts the whole shift. Okay, it lasts the whole shift plus. Um, so if you're working 10 hours, this is not going to go dead on you at all. Just make sure that when you charge it, on how to charge it, it has like, so in the back, it has like a little slot. And then you just plug it up and then this part turns red. And then when it, you'll know it's charged when it turns blue. Um, but it takes one, literally, that's the best part about it. It takes one good charge and you're good. Um, so yeah, this is really good. And I advise you to get it if you enjoy listening to music. And it's not like the sound quality. It's not to where you can't hear because you can but again don't expect noise canceling headphones out of this okay um the next thing that i want to say is to bring a jacket 
Um, whether that you think that you're not going to get cold, um, the weather has been cold outside. When you walk outside to go to your car or to get picked up, whatever the case may be, you're going to want a jacket. Um, and also in the inside too, depending on what floor you're at, um, there's moments where like I'm having lunch and then I'll just get cold. And so I just make sure that I have a jacket with me and all that good stuff. Um, another thing that I want to say, excuse me, another thing that I want to say, hold on. Like I mentioned earlier, I have a lunch bag. Um, I make sure that I have snacks in here. Um, that's I advise you to bring snacks, whether they're healthy snacks. I honestly don't suggest eating a lot of hot Cheetos or Takis or anything like that because it's not good for you. Um, I eat a lot of granola bars. Um, there's moments, like on Saturday, I went in, I had two bags of chips a candy bar it was chocolate at that like it wasn't good I didn't feel good but usually I make sure that I not only have my lunch in here but I have snacks so when I am working I could take that five minute break and eat what I need to eat um so yeah so make sure that you bring your lunch bag um I don't bring as you can see this has a lot of room tons of room um, but when I bring lunch, I always have this in my hand and at my station because the lunch that I bring, um, it does not need to be in the refrigerator, um, at all, um, because I could just warm it up. So, yeah. The next thing is I do have my little backpack that I bring. This is like my work backpack now. Um, but I bring deodorant just in case uh because you're working 10 hours you're gonna sweat depending on how hard you're working uh i don't like stinking so <laughs> i make sure that i have deodorant um i also make sure that i have some body spray um so yeah so i make sure i have this for the ladies deodorant and body spray um and I also make sure that I have lip moisturizer. Actually, let me put some on because my lips are dry. Yeah, so I make sure that I have... Uh-oh. yeah so i've been making sure that i have lip moisturizer because you need it even though where the heck oh even though like um i have my mask on there's moments where i'll pull it off because i can't breathe so yeah the other thing i make sure that i have is a pair of gloves um, but with me, I'm actually need to throw these away because I get gloves, like e new gloves every like two days, um, because they stink <laughs> and you're touching all those filthy boxes. Like there's literally pairs of gloves in this trash bag because I like getting new pairs of gloves. And then I also, I make sure to bring my headband charger just in case, but I don't need it. And I also also make sure to bring my phone case charge, uh, my phone charger, because I be charging my phone while I'm listening to my music. Because you know, music drains your battery. So as I'm listening to music, you know, with the headband and everything, um, my phone is charging. So other than that, y'all, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below what you guys think, and if you guys are starting Amazon. Good luck to you and be positive, stay positive, stay prayed up because Amazon is not easy. 
and don't give up either. Um, but I love you guys. God love you. And I'll see you guys in the next one.